This movie was an experience, to say the least. Cyrano is a 2022 romantic musical directed by Joe Wright, starring Peter Dinklage. And I was very excited for this movie ever since I first saw the trailer in December, I believe it was last year. I was very excited. I love Peter Dinklage. I have never read or seen the original version or versions of this story. So I knew nothing about it, but I was still very excited for it. So let's go ahead and talk about it. Starting off with the good, and there's a lot to love in this movie. First of all, Peter Dinklage is absolutely terrific in this movie. I really love Peter Dinklage as an actor, and in this movie, he was absolutely spectacular. He should have gotten an Oscar nomination. I will forever be mad that he did not get an Oscar nomination for this movie, because he's great in everything, but in my opinion, this is probably his best performance I have ever seen him do. It's absolutely breathtaking what he does as the character of Cyrano. And I really loved his singing voice and everything that he does in this movie. It's absolutely beautiful. And not just him, but Haley Bennett as the character of Roxanne. She's amazing as well. Her chemistry with Peter Dinklage and also with Kelvin Harrison Jr. is absolutely terrific and I really love her performance in this movie. And speaking of Kelvin Harrison Jr., his performance as the character of Christian is also really great. Uh, he was really awkward in some scenes, but that really factored into him as a character with how socially awkward he was with people that he liked. And I really love the whole dynamic between him and Cyrano. Basically wooing Roxanne through Cyrano's letters but delivered as if they were written by Christian. It was a really great story to see that. Finally, the other performance I want to point out is Ben Mendelsohn as the villain in this movie. And I thought this was David Thewlis at first because he sounded like David Thewlis and he kind of looked like him as well with all the makeup. But Ben Mendelsohn is, in my opinion, an actor who can really do no wrong. I like him and everything I see him in. And he was absolutely amazing in this movie. He's so vile and kind of an incel that it really worked with his performance. He does a great job as this character. You really buy how absolutely vile he is. And I really love how they did that. And aside from the performances, just there's a lot to love in this movie. The music is absolutely astonishing. I can't even pick out a favorite song because all the songs in this movie were absolutely terrific. And I'm tired of the edgelord group of people who hate musicals, won't give them a chance because they're missing out on so many great works of art such as this movie because they don't like musicals. And they can't even give a good reason as to why they don't like musicals. They just don't like them. And it's gotten to the point of annoyance for me because they won't even give them a chance no matter how good someone says they are. If you don't like musicals, please give this movie a chance at least because this movie is absolutely terrific from the music, the performances, the costume design is absolutely terrific. The editing is great. The choreography for the songs is, is top notch. And the emotional beats in this movie are absolutely amazing, especially the last 15 to 20 minutes of this movie. It is so breathtaking how this movie wraps up. And when I think it's actually going to wrap up, there's actually an additional 10 minutes and the additional 10 minutes is probably the most emotional bit of the movie with how it wraps up the entire story and ties up some loose ends. It's really great. And just the way this movie is shot, the camera angles, the set design, the landscaping, it's all absolutely beautiful. I cannot sing this movie's praises enough. But I'm going to go ahead and move on to the bad. 
which I have no bad. So let's move on to the final thoughts. I loved Cyrano. It's absolutely the best movie I've seen so far this year, and it's going to take one hell of a movie to top it. I don't know if anything will, um, but it's very early in the year, so anything can happen. But as it stands right now, Cyrano is an absolutely beautiful work of art, and I'm giving it a 10 out of 10. So that was my review for Cyrano. Have you seen this movie? What did you think of it if you have seen it? Let me know down in the comments. If you have not seen it, what's your favorite movie from Peter Dinklage? I'd love to hear from you. As always, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you all next time.